Thanksgiving, of course, was last week. Many people started traveling. We saw uh, the highest number of people visit airports since mid-March. Um, when do you think we'll start to see the results of family gatherings uh, uh, in the numbers? So this is that new term, um, surge on the surge. Mm. Uh, I mean, this, this second or in some cases third surge uh, looks like it's going to be at least as big and has the potential to like really bust out. So we're on the crest of a fairly big surge nationally now. That's pretty obvious. And the Thanksgiving, uh, people will get infected. They start getting symptomatic five, eight days later. They start getting sick enough to go to a hospital around 10 to 14 days. And then somewhere around three weeks or so, we start to see incremental deaths. So there's a, there's a huge lag, mm. but we're going to start to see this deep um, towards the Christmas holidays. Right. And, uh, it's just going to overwhelm the healthcare system. There's no two ways about it. Dr. Gabe Kellen in Baltimore, Director of Emergency Medicine at Johns Hopkins Medicine. Thanks so much for your time. We should note that Johns Hopkins Bloomberg School of Public Health is supported by Michael R. Bloomberg, the founder of Bloomberg LP and Bloomberg Philanthropies. The biggest stories, the moment they happen from around the globe. Subscribe to Bloomberg Quick Take now for insight in an instant.